ahead there, Drew. All right, but this next caller, the, the, Tara, don't call me Tara. Tara, don't call me Tara has written this strange word up here, and I'm interested in what they're right. asking about. This is Drew, who's 24. Hello, Drew? Mr. Drew. Yes, uh, thank hey. you for taking my call. Yeah. Um, I have a hair condition, I guess the beauticians call aeropecia areata. Oh, my God. Is she... Is she... <laughs> She wrote the weirdest word up here. It's, it, what you've got is called alopecia areata, uh -huh. which is you've got patches of hair loss. That's correct. And it's an inflammatory process, sometimes brought on by like stress, like you're in a car accident or something. Look at the words she put up there. You see that? Yeah, like Tara, spelling. Tara, let me let me count the letters in Tara's word. Here. One word. It's got like 19 well, it's letters. It's one word. In. Yeah, no, no vowels. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen letters in that word. That and I'm not going to try to, to phonetically, I'm going to try to phonetically pronounce it. Go ahead. Erepisakahirayata. <laughs> Yanahe! Yanachekaya! <laughs> this means he wants war. Nanaheche! Nanayakagaya! Many buffaloes have been killing, killed by the white skin. Nana cheche kayana, ayana dete, tanayaya rata ayana te. He says his hair is falling out. <laughs> okay. He who so his so, name is swings with barbers. What would you like to know about it? Well, I would like to know: is it going to grow back? First of all, ever? yes. Usually, it does come back. And I was seeing a dermatologist and getting steroid treatments in the shot. Steroid injections, yeah. That's it's, the standard treatment. And it's very painful. Yeah, it's an uncomfortable thing. And I just wondered um, if there isn't anything wrong with my health or people are telling me my immune system might be changing or... No, who's telling you this? Why would the dermatologist do this if it were something bad for you? I, I don't know. That's why I'm okay. going to ask. They won't do that. The, the standard idea here is that you infuse steroids right in and around the hair follicle. Really what happens is your immune system attacks the hair follicles and causes them all to fall out. And if you can reverse that by putting some anti-inflammatories there just locally, the hair comes back. Yeah. And were, you, were you in a car accident or something? Yeah, hey. Nana che. Nana he che ka. Tana che nana wa. You put a funnel. Nana che. All right. No, 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 no. Here, this one's for you, Adam. No, Greg? it's true. You just hung no. up on it. <laughs> well, this one's for you anyway. Greg is 24. Yeah, hey. Greg, yeah. How you guys doing? No, no. Hello. Che, <laughs> che. Yeah, I have a question for you guys. No, Yeah. I, I have a problem, a pooping problem. No, no, che. No, no, yeah, hey. Yeah, hey. Yes? I poop about three to five times a day. All right, let me get my scratch pad out. Three to five a day. Yeah. So this problem has been doing. It's been like a month. I had this problem. Mm. I want to know if there was something wrong with me, or I don't know. Are you adding? Are you taking more bulk in your diet than you're used to from some source? Mm. You're taking bran or you know Nothing. raisin bran or something? Hmm? No, no. You eat a lot though, right? Uh, maybe yeah. twice a day. But well, you eat large meals. No, not really. Well, then uh, eventually you got to start crapping out parts, right? Well, I don't know. I mean, if you're not eating that much and you're taking, you know, four or five mammoth dumps a day, <laughs> don't eventually you just got to, you know, crap out your liver. Well, I don't know. I have no idea. I don't eat that much a day. Are you are you losing vast amounts of weight? Yeah, I'm losing weight. You want diarrhea? Yeah. Diarrhea? Is this diarrhea or is this um, solid stools? No, it's not diarrhea. It's regular poop. Mm-hmm. No, I'm not sure. How much you nene? Nene kaka. Chicha no makrapa. No, no, no. Hecha. He says they well, his tribe walked for many, many moons. Hunt the buffalo. But the white man kills the buffalo. And now his people go hungry. Hane kacha chena waha. He says. So is, is there yes. something wrong with me? <laughs> no. Listen, it, listen, uh, Greg. Th that this what comes out is is roughage and bulk. If there's some large amount, seemingly more than you're putting in. I mean, what do you eat a lot of salads and that kind of thing? Yeah, I, I have salads. I have. Well, I eat a lot of salads. Yeah. All right. Well, that's where it's coming from. There's somewhere you're getting bulk that's not digestible. Oh, um, really? Yeah, and that's what's happening. Hold on. So, Hold on. No, not a bad thing. It's a good thing. Well, Chief Running Turd wants to say something. <laughs> He says his people have seen this before. Ah. The man who poops like an elephant. Ah. 
he is known. There's many drawings and songs sung about this man who poops like an elephant. He is known as the poop one. <laughs> All right, where are we? Now, Drew, let me ask you this. Let me, let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Ask me. Um, if in uh, if in if in you're losing weight, yes, or is there extra? I know it's not extra like stool, but if you're losing weight, if you're burning off calories and you're burning fat, or no. you're absorbing the fat, what are you doing with this fat? You are you are burning it for fuel. It's it's turning into energy. Right. It is not it is it is not manifested in any way in uh, your movements or your urine or anything the urine, like that. The urine. There's certain things that come out in there, but uh, it's 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 energy. Judge Emma. Mm. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Heather, uh, for, for yeah. my money, not enough American, real sort of Hollywood Indians on TV anymore. You know, we we lost track of that in the 70s. Somewhere. Yeah, yeah. Now we see the real Indians, you know, a bunch of fat guys who are drunk and they're playing, you know, pan poker somewhere on a reservation in Idaho. But I kind of miss that real stone chiseled face guy, you know, really? who who knew he would like put his ear down to the ground and go, mm, many men come this way, iron horse. Rape the land. You know, give it that whole thing. He'd tell you, like, how many horses, and then he'd tell you, like, one horse. He'd be looking at the tracks. One horse had two riders. Track deep. Right. You know, and he, right. he knew everything. One horse was, was brown with white spots. The other was white with brown. It was like, <laughs> this guy's telling you everything, what they had for lunch. I miss that Indian. And, you know, you know, the Indians, they don't like to be depicted that way. Right. Oh, uh, wh why? What's so bad about the brave guy who knows everything? Right. Do you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you.